All right, today, guys, I want to make a real quick video on one of my favorite simplistic mods, and that is Quick Stack. Now, with Quick Stack, what you can do is you can run by chests, you can set up a key bind, and it'll deposit the items from your inventory into any of the chests that already have a stack of items in there. It's one thing that I really hate in Valheim is when I'm digging through all the chests to make sure I'm stacking things where they need to be. But this makes that so much easier. But uh, before we get into installing it, I just wanted to say YouTube analytics have been telling a sad tale. Only 1% of my viewers are subscribed, so if this video does help you out and you really enjoy the mod, make sure you subscribe, and hopefully I'll catch you in the next video. But uh, back to getting this. What's also nice about this mod is the server does not need to have it for it to work. You can play on any server and this mod's going to work perfectly fine. But uh, we'll get into that right now. If you have Bep and X pack, uh, I was told I pronounced that wrong. I hope I'm pronouncing it right now. But uh, if you have this already uh, or the full, then you won't have to install this. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get this for people who don't have it. I'm going to click this manual download here, save it to my downloads. And then we'll head over here. And both of these links will be down in the description, by the way. And we're going to download the quick stack mod also. And I'm going to save that file. And now what we're going to want to do is I'm going to head over to Steam. Here's Valheim. I'm going to right click, go to properties, local files, and browse these local files. And it'll bring up this, these folders right here. Now I'm going to head over to my downloads right here on the left hand side. And once we're in here, we're going to go to the Bepinex pack right here. Open this up, open this file up, and this is what we have to copy. Just highlight all of that, right click, hit copy. Then we're going to hit this back arrow, back arrow again, and again, and it'll take me back into my Valheim folder. I can right click in here and hit paste. And give it its time, and then once that's copied over, I'm going to head into Bepinex folder and then into plugins this is where we're going to be pasting the uh, plugin or mod so i'm going to head back over to my downloads go into the quick stack folder and this is the file we need right here so I'll right click hit copy and i'll hit the back arrow and again and paste it in here and we can start up valheim just real quick i want to start it up to generate the config and then we'll configure it, and i'll show you how to set up keybinds but Shouldn't take too long to start up, and once it does, we can close right out. Alright, now the Valheim's loaded up, we can close out. Head over here in Steam, right click on Valheim, go to Properties, Local Files, and Browse. And once that loads up, we can head into here, into Config, and right here is the Quick Stack Config. I'm just going to right click and hit Edit with Notepad++. Plus plus. You can just edit with notepad or whatever you choose to use. Uh, but right here is where you'd configure what key you want it to be. Right here is a reference to all the key codes. I'm going to open that up real quick. Uh, so you can get an idea of what's going on. Just depending on whatever you want, just come in here and this is what you have to put into place. I'm just going to be using G. It's pretty easy and it's pretty close. Uh, so you can close out of this. I'm just going to get rid of this here and put G in its place, capital G that is, and save it. I can close out of that, I'll load up Valheim and I'll show you guys the mod on my server. Because I just have a bunch of stuff I collected in my inventory, I'm going to head to our storage area and I'll just show you, us, or show you me dropping it all off real quick, just to show, show how easy it is to use. I love the mod. So glad it's a thing. Gotta wait for this startup, shouldn't take very long. Alright, now that's started up. I'm gonna start game, start, join game, join IP. I'm gonna blur this out because uh, as much as I like you guys watching my videos, I don't want you on my server, sadly. Alright. Just gotta type in the password. And, uh,. Shouldn't take long to load in. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys this because you don't need any mod or any mods on the server side, which is really nice. Uh, we don't have any on our server side, so this is a good test. <laughs> and there we go. We're in game. 
I'm gonna head to the storage area real quick. Oh, over here. I just have like a row of chests set up that I can run around and drop off my stuff. So now that I'm in here, I have that keybind configured. I can just hit G as I'm walking around in here. It empties out all the stuff I have in my inventory. And if there's anything left, I can see that it didn't stack the wood. So I have wood stored over here. I just add a new stack in a container. Oh, wow. We have a lot of wood in here. Holy cow. But I can just put that in here. G and it'll pull that rest in there. And it won't pull food items out of your inventory, which is really nice. But uh, with these mushrooms and such, uh, they just kind of clutter your inventory. But uh, hey, if this video did help you out, liking and subscribing would be much appreciated. And uh, hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.